Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you guys are new here for the first time, then hello, welcome. In today's video, we are doing yet another Ray Dunn haul for you guys. I am so excited to share with you the items that I picked up within the past week or so. This is definitely going to be a smaller haul. There's not a ton of stuff to share with you guys, but a lot of exciting things nonetheless. I was able to get three of my big unicorns, so I'm so excited to share those with you guys. I will also be going to Mexico if you guys didn't know. So please let me know in the comments down below if you guys would like to see any videos while I'm out there. I'm not 100% sure if I will be vlogging, but if you guys do wanna see a vlog while I'm in Mexico, let me know. I'm also very excited about that trip. So without further ado, if you guys would like to see what I picked up this week, just go ahead and keep on watching. So jumping right into this video, I want to apologize for the lighting again. I feel like I always have to apologize for the lighting because I try to get it as good as I can, but sometimes it's just a little rough. The sun is like setting right now, so I have to use some artificial light and yeah, that's that. I did want to try a different background up as well. That's why I'm in this little corner today. I also want to apologize for my doggies, they are currently eating their food which is right next to us. So if you hear that, that is them. I apologize, they're gonna be walking around eating some food while we do this video. So the first thing that I'm going to share with you guys are all of the mugs that I got from the past week or so. So one of my Dunn buddies actually was able to get me two of the mugs that I've been wanting for a really long time. So the first mug that I got is the Never Done mug. All of their mugs are $5.99, which you guys probably already know, but I will mention if anyone is new. I love this mug so much because it is so true. I truly believe that I will never be done completely. Maybe one of these days in the far, far future I will be, but I love this and this is very true. So I'm very happy to have that mug. I did also get the Done Life mug, which this one is 100% my life. I love everything and anything Ray Done. You guys know this, so this one is definitely a great add to my collection of mugs. The next mug that I got is actually from one of the girls north of me. She actually did a purge on our local Facebook page and I was able to snag this one up from her. It is the typewriter print, but I absolutely love this mug so much and I was able to snag it up from her. So thank you girl for this mug. I absolutely love it. So it is the Nest mug. I just think it is the cutest thing in the world. I usually don't like typewriter stuff, but this one is definitely an exception. Moving on to the next thing, I got the popcorn bowl, which I have been wanting this for so long, you guys. It is actually back in circulation but I did actually get this in a trade and now I'm wondering what I traded for this. I believe I traded some salt and pepper sellers and a postable for this, so I was very happy because honestly, I don't hunt very often and I probably wasn't gonna find this, so thank you, thank you for making this trade with me. I'm so excited to have some popcorn, watch some Netflix, and it's gonna be a good time. All right, so now we're moving into the more exciting items. So this first one is actually from one of my done friends here where I live. I feel like I've created so many friendships from the redone world, and it's just kind of amazing to me just some of the relationships that I've created. So I was actually able to surprise her with one of her unicorn items that she's been wanting for a very long time. And I was actually able to get one of my birdhouses that I had traded like months and months ago. She didn't really want it anymore, so she went ahead and asked me if I wanted it. So thank you so much. I love it. I cannot wait to get a decal for the side of it. It is the Wish Birdhouse. 
I found these or my parents found these way back in like December when they were on vacation and I went ahead and traded them the peace and wish one and I was always kind of sad that I traded the wish one because I had seen a bunch of people get like the little decal of the dandelion and I thought it was the cutest thing ever so if you guys know where to get one of the decals for this birdhouse let me know in the comments down below I know I can look on Etsy but I would just rather ask you guys if you have gotten one and it was good quality so excited to add this to my collection I need to redo my little cabinet area because I am running out of room you guys it is kind of crazy I need to take out my watering cans I think out of there which I have no idea what I'm gonna do with them after that but Yes, I need to redo that so I can add my new birdhouses in there. The next birdhouse that I got, I am literally so shocked that it's even mine. I actually won this on a raffle. I had no idea that I won because I was actually at work with a client and the game that I played took a while to fill so I didn't even think that they were gonna end up running it because it just wasn't filling fast enough, but they ended up running it and I won. I paid $10 for this baby. This has been one of my biggest unicorns since the very beginning. So this is my new baby, the round home birdhouse. I am so in love with this baby. My dog is coming up to join the video yet again. Don't mind her. I love it because it has a bunch of dimples all over it. It does have the cute little flowers right there in the back and I love the pretty lilac bow that it has on it as well. I am just so in love with this thing, you guys. I feel like it's a lot of people's unicorn item and it was definitely mine. My last unicorn birdhouse that I want is the round tweet, which I'm sure you guys already know. It's on everyone's ISO and I feel like it's everyone's unicorn. Thankfully, I do not love the Homeline birdhouse, so I definitely don't need that, which is good because I feel like that would be pretty, pretty impossible to get. All right, so moving on to the next item, we are going to go away from birdhouses just for a second. So I was actually at work the other day and my mom had texted me and she was at Marshall's and she asked if I needed a sweets canister. And as soon as I read that text message, I called my mom so fast. And when she answered, I said, you need to run back over to that aisle and pick up the sweets canister. I could not believe it. It was like 1.30 in the afternoon. So it wasn't at opening at all. It was in the middle of the day. And I feel like our Marshalls here where I live usually does that. They don't put a lot of stuff out at openings anymore. I've heard, I haven't been to an opening there in a really long time. So who knows? I don't know what happened, but they had the sweets canister and I could not be more happy. So I now have the Chubby Sweets canister. This has definitely been on my ISO list since I started collecting as well, but I honestly thought I was never going to get it just because, I don't know, I don't hunt very much and I don't know, I just kind of gave up looking for it and I also took it off of my ISO list to be honest with you guys because I do have these Skinny Sweets that has a bunch of the dimples on it. It's not like the OG sweets. It's the one that came out the year after the OG one. Um, so I didn't really feel like I needed it. So I took it off my ISO list and wouldn't you know, it shows up. So I'm very happy. This canister is so cute. It's the size of the snack canister. If you guys are wondering the size and this was $12.99. So definitely on the affordable side as well. Now I need the Chubby Treats canister, so if you guys have one of those, let your girl know because I definitely want that one now that I have the sweets one. The next item that I got, I want to just take a second to thank this sweet girl up north of me. She actually found a bunch of the acorn birdhouses and I was one of the first people to message her and we had originally planned for another trade and she ended up getting 
a different trade for it. So she had messaged me and asked me if I had anything else. And let me just tell you, she was so generous for trading for what we did. Um, I ended up getting her a cute little card and getting her a gift card just to thank her for her generosity because honestly, I still can't believe that this baby is mine. So I got the Chirp Acorn Birdhouse. I love this little guy so much. I had never seen one in person, obviously. I actually am also getting the Acorn Live Birdhouse. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you probably wouldn't have seen, but my friend over in Chicago actually found me the Live Birdhouse. No idea when I'm gonna be getting that one, but hopefully sometime soon, I will put it in a haul video for you guys. Again, all of these birdhouses are $19.99. And it has the cute little teal bow on it. So that concludes all of the Ray Dunn that I got, but I wanted to show you guys the cute little birds that I picked up. So I think I showed you the white ones that I got a few haul videos back. They have the little crowns on them and I actually found them in all gold and I thought they were very cute. So I went ahead and picked them up as well. These retail for $4.99. And then my dad actually got me two of these cute little birds. A lot of you guys asked where they were from because I posted a picture on my Instagram stories. So the first one that he got me is this cute little black one. I love him so much. He has these little stick legs and his little beak is so cute. Like, are you kidding me? I love it so much. So that's the first one that he got me and then he actually got me a brown version of that one but when i unwrapped it it was broken sadly so i think the lady who wrapped it ended up breaking it but he also got me this cute little white one so it's a little bit different it's like the little fatter version of the black one it has the big beak coming out there with the same little stick legs i just love him isn't he so cute like these are literally the cutest birdies ever so thank you so much dad I appreciate it. They are going to go in my little cabinet area with all of my birdhouses. So that is going to complete this haul video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye, Steamer Bliss.